Hello everybody and welcome to Excel Made Easy. I'm your Excel Guru and today I'm going to tell you how to change the tab colors in your worksheet in all your worksheets in an Excel book using VBA. Uh, let's do an example. Uh, here are around six sheets. Three of them are already c having green color. Now if I press this button change tab color what will see uh, what will happen all the sheets are now in green color uh, we can change the colors uh, here are the c here is a list of numbers which correspond to colors I'll tell you how to use it let us see how to do it now before doing any VBA programming we have to ensure we click on this office button we go to Excel options and then we check this box show developer tab in the ribbon and then click on OK and then you'll have this developer button in your developer tab open up in your Excel file. Now to write a VBA code we have to ensure we go to Visual Basic module. You can go by two ways either by clicking over here or by pressing Alt F11. Now I press I click on this button and here this thing open up. Do not be intimidated by what this is. This is nothing much once you get a hang of, of it. It's very very simple. Uh, what we need to do is uh, this is uh, uh, the code that I've already written uh, for you how you would have to access it you would have to click on insert you'll have to click on module and then this module would open up and it would be blank you'd have to type the code in the uh, the first thing that you have to do is type in sub sub then space and then this name it can be any name I have given this myself change tab color and then open and close bracket then write DIM DIM sheet as worksheet that means we are asking that Excel okay this has to be treated uh, for my worksheets now we are giving it a command for each sheet in worksheets I would like uh, Excel that for each sheet in the worksheet we would like the color to be changed so how do we tell that SHT dot tab dot color index is equal to 4 now 4 represents a color now 4 represents green now if I type in say 3 it will change now after that ensure we type in next only then would it uh, cover all the sheets and then we have to type end sub every uh, code which is starting with a sub has to end with end sub now we can run it click anywhere within your code and then hit this run sub button see the, co the colors have changed to red I type in say 7 and let us see we run it again the color has changed to pink and let's see what is if I type 12 this is something new for me also the color is oh wow 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 cool cool <laughs> this is fun this is fun so let, let's keep it to 1 let us see how this have what is 1 ok 1 is black grey so this is how it is uh, you, we press S save it and then we can close this you get back to your Excel now we can run this uh, macro by two ways either by Alt F8 or by clicking over here it will show you the current macros available to you click on change tab color and run it it will run how do we run uh, we add new sheets to it and then we'll see how it runs macros run and it has changed the tab colors now there is one more way which I like uh, changing it using a button a command button how to insert a command button now go to developer tab again go to insert click on form controls click on this button and then place the button anywhere this is resizable editable so as soon as you place this button uh, automatically assign macro or window opens up you assign a macro to this button and you click on OK and then you rename it or resize it uh, see I have renamed my button to change tab color and click over here and see the other tabs have also changed their color isn't it cool you can try with these options this Excel file shown in this video is available for free download on my website excelmadeeasy.weebly.com All you need to do is just go to this website, go to this page, training files 
and download the file for free. This video is also available on YouTube where you, have, you can watch it. Uh, you can also choose to go to my English videos playlist, my Excel website, my Facebook and Twitter pages. Do like me and follow me on Facebook and Twitter. And last but not the least and very important, do what I am doing. Share your knowledge or at best share this video. Click on the share button and then this option would open up. You can share it on Facebook, on or Koot or show more option and share it with your friends. I would like you to do that. That would be a help for me. So this is your Excel Guru signing off for the day. Have a wonderful day ahead. Happy Excel learning.